Good morning, folks. We've got a couple major things to hit today. Space weather, an earthquake swarm, and three top stories, including the massive ozone hole. We'll start with our star, and we find the last 24 hours on the sun was mostly quiet, minor flaring, but the solar wind here at Earth is another story. A mild disruption in the solar wind is actually triggering minor geomagnetic storm conditions. The event is nothing scary and should wane back today, but meanwhile, we've got lots of sunspots and plasma filaments to monitor, and we'll be doing that. Coming back to the earthquake swarm we highlighted yesterday, it hasn't stopped. Tons of seismic activity off the coast of Japan reaching now up to magnitude 6, really hoping this region calms down today. First article hits volcanic winter. This looks at repeated events in the Cretaceous period and adds to the evidence that while Earth may take breaks from volcanic winter like we're in now, eventually the Earth kicks itself back into cold, and we're overdue. Up next, the scientists can't avoid the fact that record cold and snow isn't disappearing, so what do they do? Rewrite the global warming story to now include the expectation of major extreme cold waves. They can't avoid the truth, so they try to spin it, which I do admit is better than not acknowledging it at all. Top story today is the Antarctic ozone hole. It's massive this year, and not only does this come just a few months after they said the recovery should be well underway, but the supposed ozone-destroying chemical pollution is way down, and so are the wildfires they tried to blame for the big holes that appeared the last couple years. Folks, the continued appearance of massive ozone holes, in spite of decreased particulate interference, is something we've said for years to watch due to the increased particle flux from the sun, with Earth's weakening magnetic field unable to block them out. It's happening again, and it's happening big time. We're about nine days away from our next Observer event. Come hang out with me and Rocky and the Big Burb. Tickets found at the link below, and we'd love to see you out there. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now at 6.15 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.